in this problem you have secant theta plus alpha secant theta minus alpha is 2 secant theta he is asking 1 plus cos alpha should be written in terms of theta that means you have to separate from the above condition theta and alpha let me take up secant theta plus alpha plus secant theta minus alpha is equal to 2 secant theta convert to cos 1 by cos theta plus alpha 1 by cos theta minus alpha is 2 by cos theta take LCM cos theta plus alpha into cos theta minus alpha cos of theta minus alpha plus cos of theta plus alpha is equal to 2 by cos theta apply formula cos theta cos alpha plus sin theta sin alpha plus cos theta cos alpha minus sin theta sin alpha divided by cos of theta plus alpha into cos of theta minus alpha is 2 by cos theta. These two they get cancelled. So you get 2 cos theta cos alpha by cos theta plus alpha into cos theta minus alpha is 2 by cos theta. Now you cross multiply. You get 2 cos square theta cos alpha is equal to 2 into cos of theta plus alpha into cos of theta minus alpha. 2 cancels. Cos square theta cos alpha. You have cos a plus b into cos a minus b is cos square a minus sin square b cos square b minus sin square a we have proved. Now, here you apply one of that formula. Since you have cos square theta, you write this as cos square theta minus sin square alpha. You bring cos sin square alpha one side and cos square theta cos alpha one side. Cos square theta minus cos square theta cos alpha is equal to sin square alpha take cos square theta common 1 minus cos square alpha sin square alpha can be written as 1 minus cos square alpha cos square theta into 1 minus cos alpha is 1 plus cos alpha into 1 minus cos alpha 1 minus cos alpha gets cancelled you get 1 plus cos alpha is cos square theta.